Keep your eye on the town of Emerald during episodes of BYU TV's Ruby and the Well. Ruby's special gift for bringing hopes and dreams to reality rub off on the place she calls home. Her efforts and the magic of her well brighten people's lives. And Emerald's atmosphere takes on a new polish. Transforming the town is up to Ruby and the Well's creative and production teams. Alkmaar. The art department do a lot of work on photographs and graphics and the props, the set dressing, the wardrobe. Weeks of prep go into pulling all the details together in order to uh, really support the characters and the mood of the stories. Time to get my hands dirty. One of the things you're going to really notice is how much the town has come back to life. So much more color, more activity, just a different kind of energy. And this has all happened because Ruby's brought the wishes off, and the more wishes that have been pulled off, the town has come back to life with it. We're back. I'm the production designer, so it's my responsibility for the general look of the show. So that's props, set decoration, uh, construction, everything like that. It all starts from the script. For instance, we had a, a flower shop. So that was, that was in the script and we had to identify where on the street we would like that. And then I went to work to design an interior for that. So I go on, on the internet and I find images that I think suit the feel of the show. If everyone's happy, then I go ahead and start planning the set and looking at colors. We like to have some red hits on all of the sets, uh, nothing too overpowering, just little bits and pieces here and there. The setting of the scene impacts my performance by the environment that is created around the scene because it feeds the characters inside of the scene. The setting of where you are is another character in it. So when we're filming in the O'Reilly house, you know, this is our home and it's more intimate so you can have more vulnerable and emotional scenes here. As you can see, we have racks and racks of clothing. We actually picked three different gemstones for the three leads. So we have Ruby, who's red, red Ruby. Mina, amethyst, purple. And Sam is sapphire blue. Go to the malls, go online, go to vintage stores, shop like crazy, fill up racks, have fittings, and then return the things that don't work. We probably have about 10 outfits that we try on the actor to figure out the one outfit. A set is a really special place to be. And I think that on this show, in particular, when you watch the show, the magic that you see on your TV screens uh, is just a reflection of the magic that happens here. Catch the transformations, both in the characters and the setting of Ruby and the Well. Tune in or watch anytime with the free BYU TV app. Thanks for watching BYU TV Insider.